Today is Wednesday. It's West Wednesdays today. It's Wednesday, November the 25th, 2015. Tomorrow's Thanksgiving. But this is about Barbara Mikulski. This is in the Baltimore Sun. Like I said, we're going to hold the media accountable. And Barbara Mikulski, we're going to hold you accountable. Because the state of black Baltimore is what you've been denying. You got a medal for leaving us in the prison industry and leaving us locked up. This is me. That's me. I'm a Baltimore City citizen. I'm a resident of Baltimore City. And that's a Privacy Act release. And that Privacy Act release was in 2009. All right. Lisa Madigan, Attorney General, Dutch Rufusberger, Senator Card, and Senator Durbin, Attorney General. That's my case number. False imprisonment for filming a documentary about racism in the Lake County judicial system. Denial of due process, equal protections, and freedom of speech. And you giving her a medal of freedom, a medal of honor, when she's sitting here permitting this prison industry and cradle of prison pipeline to exist? When she's denying blacks, Hispanics, and poor whites the equal representation in the seats of Congress that we supposed to have? We dying out here, man. This is about murder by police. And since Freddie Gray's death, you had seven police, police shootings since Freddie Gray's death. So you need to add something to the list. I'm a community activist. That's my son. Tomorrow I won't be spending Thanksgiving with my son. I'll be, think, I'll be spending Thanksgiving with his memory. And that's what I do in the community. I police the police. I provide jobs. And I lobby for the unpaid. And I lobby for the... I lobby for my community. It's so making a movie in the documentary. And the movie in the documentary was about how you treat black people in America. That's Governor O'Malley. And that's the movie release. And this is the case. Just like in Chicago, when they held up that film and they didn't give the people that, that film and they settled for that family out of state for $5 million, I was suing the state of Maryland for $54 million for the prison industry. I was suing the state of Maryland for an astronomical amount of money, and this was the witness list and the people involved in it. This is a motion to squash the subpoenas because Governor O'Malley uses the courts to protect him with the lawyers and the judges. And Mikulski is in bed with him. Right in bed with him. Because I asked to be defended. I asked to have this issue about racism that's prevalent today to be discussed in 2009. Now you're reaping what you sowed. These are the people on the, on the witness list. That everybody in here knows that I was making a movie about racism in the American judicial system. They know that I was making a movie about the prison industry. They know what I was doing. Everybody. And y'all running for office and y'all running for mayor. That's Carl Stokes and Kathleen Pugh. All right. All this is legal. It's on court record. That's the media. Christian Schaefer. Christian Schaefer from ABC2 News has this minority report. Christian Schaefer has it. Governor O'Malley had it. Senator Mikulski got it. So if you're going to give her a Medal of Freedom, what you going to do about the refugees and the blacks that's locked up in the prison industry because of Barbara Mikulski, because of Governor O'Malley, because of Dutch Rufus Berger. The system of incarceration is slavery reinvented by the Senate, the Congress, and our elected officials. And President Obama asked for an investigation. I'm the subject of the investigation, Prez. I'm the one that you're supposed to be defending because our community is in crisis. And we dying out here. We getting murdered by the police from New York to California to Chicago to Baltimore. We dying out here. And something needs to be done about it. We can't keep being treated the way we being treated. It's just that simple. I lost my son. I know how it feels. Mikulski, you need to defend our rights.